Welcome to Man Kitchen Recipes. I'm Kevin and today we're going to do a chicken pot pie. Uh, this chicken pot pie was inspired to me from Mrs. Sonia Elaine on YouTube. Uh, she made some chicken pot pies uh, a little while ago and hers are all nice and fancy looking but I decided to do mine on the, on the Lone Star Grill's pellet grill. And I'm going to use the leftover chicken from that. Uh, I didn't know what to call it at the time, but it's called a frog style chicken, bullfrog chicken, leapfrog chicken. But you know what? We're in New Mexico. We're not only known for our green chilies. We're also known for the little green men. So I call it the alien chicken, a smoked alien chicken. I'm using the leftovers from the alien chicken for this chicken pot pie. Let's get inside. I'm going to show you how we do it. We're going to get this going. Okay, first thing I'm going to do is chop up the uh, leftover chicken just like that. Then we're going to make a roux. I'm just going to add about five tablespoons of butter, about a half a cup of uh, flour. I'm going to mix it up, let it cook for a minute or two, add some chicken stock. I've got a couple of cups of chicken stock here. And then I'm going to add about a three quarter cup of milk. And then you want to just mix it around, let it uh, simmer for a little while. It'll get a little thick. Once it thickens up, I'm going to add some salt and pepper. And then I'm going to add my chicken. I'm going to add all that chicken that we chopped up in here. It's going to be nice and uh, full of chicken. And then I'm going to go ahead and uh, add some mixed vegetables. These are frozen. I had them out, so they're not quite frozen right <laughs> Mix that up. I'm going to add a little bit more corn to this. This corn is frozen. And also get that mixed up. And then you'll see the consistency once it's all mixed up. I'm going to add a little bit more chicken stock to thin it out. And there we go. We're going to let this simmer for about 10 or 15 minutes. And I'm going to get my store-bought pie crust in the pan. We're going to get it out to the pellet grill and let it cook for approximately 5 minutes or so. Okay, it's been just about 5 minutes. So while we wait the next, you know, I think 5 minutes be enough uh, going on this pellet smoker. Anyway, again, this was inspired by Mrs. Sonia Elaine. If you haven't seen her channel, go check it out. I will leave a link below. She does a lot of great cooks. She does a lot of great things with her kids, and uh, she's got a really good channel. So check her out, and uh, I'll leave a card at the end of this video uh, for you to uh, go watch that alien smoked alien chicken video. I think you might like it, if you haven't seen it already. It's pretty cool. All right, let's check this out. Did bubble up. I got a little tiny bubble right here. I think that's okay. I'm gonna let it go for about 30 more seconds. While we wait, you know, I mean, I think it's probably been, I'm gonna guess about four years since I've made a chicken pot pie, and it was so good. I don't know why I haven't made one since, but uh, hey, I thought I'd make a great video on this Lone Star Grills pellet grill. I mean, pellet grills are so versatile. And uh, you know I want to use this. <laughs> All right, let's pull this out and take it in, fill it up, cover it up, bring it back out, and bake it. All right, well, there it is. Right there, not too bad. Let's go fill it up. All right, all you want to do is add your uh, chicken pot pie filling into that crust that we just baked get it nice and full spread it out a little bit boy this is full too <laughs> all right we're going to put the other pie crust on top you just want to go around the edges seal it really well and just like that we're ready to cut some slices in it so it can steam add some egg wash and then we're going to take it out and get this thing going there we go chicken pot pie going in the lone star grill that okay I'll probably check it I mean it's probably gonna go 30 anywhere between 30 and 40 minutes I'll probably check it in about 20 just to make sure it's not burning and uh, hey we'll be back All right, it's been 20 minutes let's give it a look hey let me get you up there a little bit it's looking pretty good Put my glove on that out. See some edges getting a little dark. So uh, for the next 10 minutes or so, got this handy dandy pie ring to protect the crust. 
throw it back in. We'll check it out in another five, 10 minutes. Okay, we're 30 minutes total here. Yeah, it's bubbling over. Look at this. Looks pretty good, huh? I think we can take that off. We'll let this go about five more minutes without this little cover on it. Looking good. All right, five more minutes, 35 minutes total so far. Look at that. I think we're done. We're gonna take this off and uh, get in closer for you. Look at that. All right, we're gonna take this off and we're probably gonna let this thing uh, cool for 15 to 20 minutes. It is hot. We'll bring you back for a taste test. Okay, and there we go. So that nice slice of uh, chicken pot pie done in the uh, Lone Star Grills pellet grill. Thank you so much, Sonia, for the idea. It obviously, obviously doesn't look as pretty as yours did, so if you guys want to see Sonia's, go check out her channel. I'll put, their, I'll put her link below. Let's give this a try. Oh, we always serve our... Uh, chicken pot pies on some basmati rice so good so here we go cheers mm. Mm. I gotta tell you using that leftover smoked chicken you definitely get the smoky flavor in this uh, chicken pot pie so good mmm mmm all right, once again, if you haven't seen that alien chicken video yet, check out that video card at the end here. So thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Hopefully we'll see you again on the next video. Again, go check out this alien chicken right there. <laughs>